what is my message for the women of Afghanistan? I think Afghan women are as strong, as courageous, as resourceful, and as creative as they can be, and as they have ever been. They don't need anyone else to save them and rescue them. They, what they need is a break from the ongoing war and violence for them to focus on their lives and be able to get on with what they want to achieve and not just for themselves but for their kids and society. Well, back in the country, my message to Afghan women, particularly the new generation of Afghan women, is that they should not surrender to fear, as we didn't surrender to fear back when the Taliban were ruling in the earlier years. I think uh, we need to strengthen our solidarity within the country and beyond the country with the global uh, women's movement and women's solidarity um, networks. Uh, I think it's, uh, it's the time for us to join hands also with our male allies and colleagues from the civil society and from our communities who have been always a strong supporter of women's rights within our families, within our communities. So we need to join our hands and give the Taliban a strong message that we are not ready to go back. I'm proud to sit here and say that Afghan women are now truly scaring the political decision makers, whether on the government side or on the opposition and the um, uh, Taliban side. They are all have, are, are in a kind of a position that they have no choice but to make a comment. And they have a little bit of a difficulties to make those comments because the way this brown Taliban is known globally is a, and accepted globally is to be anti-woman and anti uh, any form of you know opportunities that they have to provide to women. And finally, what can you do? Yeah, I mentioned my cousin, my aunt, my friend, my sister. In order for those women and the majority of Afghan women to live a life that is humane, dignified, and free, they need to have a responsible and responsible state and institutions that can not just protect them, but can provide for them, that has their interests at heart. They need a government that can respond to their needs. And that's where you can help. By supporting and lobbying for an inclusive, peaceful, and democratic Afghanistan. Thank you.